Determining Critical Control Points CCPS, for HACCP. In this video, we will discuss the process of determining critical control points CCPS, which are points in the food production process where control measures can be applied to prevent, eliminate or reduce a hazard. We will explore different factors that should be considered when determining CCPS, such as the severity of the hazard, the likelihood of occurrence, and the effectiveness of control measures. When determining CCPS, it's important to consider a number of factors, including the severity of the hazard, the likelihood of occurrence, and the effectiveness of control measures. For example, if a hazard has a high severity and a high likelihood of occurrence, it may be necessary to identify multiple CCPS in the production process. Control measures for CCPS may include temperature monitoring, pH testing, or visual inspections. It's important to document all CCPS and the control measures that are in place, as well as the frequency of monitoring and corrective actions that will be taken if a hazard is detected. In conclusion, determining CCPS is a critical step in the HCCP process. By identifying and controlling hazards at critical points in the production process, we can help ensure the safety of the food we produce.